Good morning, it's 3.58 a.m. Welcome to another Born Again. British summertime is taking a break for real summertime. The last bus, living on the edge. One minute. There's just so many things to do, I need to narrow it all down. I don't know if I can put it all in the video, but the bus is coming and... London, you can all drone it, and if anyone... Shit. Damn it, look at this. Damn it! Damn it! It couldn't have gone worse. Wow, it literally just lost control, and it just started flying, gearing off completely. It just... I just lost it. Basically, if you can't afford to replace the drone, don't get it. That's put me off a little. Sometimes you have to let go of things. Just a little bit speechless. It's kind of long having to actually go through security to get into like... People love London and I live basically in London. So let's just make a video because London's actually great. I'm so excited, it's 4 a.m. and I'm at a bus stop gonna take a night bus because I want to catch the beautiful sunrise. But also because with the drone, I don't want anyone to be around because it's kind of semi not allowed around a lot of people. So I'm thinking at 5 a.m. I'd be impressed to see anyone else awake. The last bus, just how I like it. Can you guess where I am? I put far too little duct tape. There still aren't any laws for drones, but like, I don't want to cause myself any problems. So I'm literally just going to be like... I'm being a responsible drone pilot. There is nobody out here. Furthermore, the pollution is really low, so that's another positive. <laughs> Funny how those red buses look like ants from up there. But yeah, finally got the shots I wanted. I just studied history. But I'm actually quite dyslexic. So let's go hit Parliament, guys! Which is exactly there. <laughs> that skid was a little painful. I couldn't come to Parliament Square without saying hey to my best bro, Churchill. And guess who else we're coming to say hi to? Yeah? It's Gandhi. You've got the same glasses. We have a lot in common. I found a memorial I really, really like. The women of World War II. 